Hey guys, and welcome to week four weekly accountability. So this week was pretty good. The last couple of days, I feel like I've gone over my 1200 calorie target. On Thursday, we had takeaway when I was like on the way um, to pick my daughter up. I was battling traffic and I'm thinking to myself, we might get takeaway today. I want to be careful about that because I just don't want that to like sneak in because you can justify getting takeaway a lot. There are just so many excuses to get takeaway, but I really want to like keep on top of that. You know, I don't, I just don't want it to be a regular thing yesterday um we had a day off that was amazing it was australia day yesterday so i had the day off work and aisha had the day off school and we had like a nice breakfast i thought it'd be fun to like do like a nice breakfast because usually i don't even have breakfast um and neither does aisha like she might have something really small but that was really nice so we had like um egg and bacon english muffins so it was like such a nice treat and i was thinking like i was thinking what would i will i have dinner tonight i don't know maybe i won't um just to kind of you know make sure that i'm definitely under i mean like this breakfast meal like I'm pretty sure it would have been about 600 calories because it's like the English muffin, iced coffee, bacon, egg, a little bit of avocado, cheese. I mean, like it all adds up. So I was thinking this is probably about 600 calories. Um, So I was very like, I would, it would be okay to have something small, but you know, not too much. Um, Last night I ended up making spaghetti because I show like really fancied spaghetti like the last few days so I did spaghetti and I also got like garlic bread as well so just you know I really wanted to make it really nice so I got like fresh basil and you know just yeah so it was really nice and I did have a small portion um, I had some garlic bread so I wasn't really quite sure so I think I might have just gone over 1200 calories yesterday as well i think so but other than that it was like a pretty good week i mean the weather it's been like so hot but i still went on a walk i didn't go on monday um because i caught up with a friend for lunch but on tuesday wednesday thursday i went on a walk and then gym like i went to the gym monday wednesday and yesterday morning so i did a little bit better this week with going to the gym which is pretty cool so i just got back from the gym and i'm just gonna boil my eggs and i'll do like i think i'll do one for Aisha as well um it's her first day back at school so i'm just gonna spend some time getting her lunch ready um because usually i've got got, like heaps of time so when i come back from the gym um i've got like plenty of time to boil my eggs but like i don't have as much time this morning it's monday morning and yeah i did arms and actually even holding up my phone right now is like kind of making this arm like tired oh my gosh food wise i'm kind of I'm okay with how I did this week. I did get takeaway as well though on Saturday. So I feel like certain things I'm really happy with, you know, I just like stuck to what I've been doing, which is really, really good. But then like other days, I'm just very aware that like I've had three days where I have gone over my calories. I'm pretty sure I have. Possibly yesterday I didn't. That was kind of like maybe, maybe I did, I don't know. But yeah i'm not i'm not quite sure so i'd rather just be like okay like let's just say if i'm not 100 percent sure then i'll just say okay no like i'm unsure about it so i'm not under 1200 calories so it's kind of yeah it's a little bit annoying um but other than that i'm pretty happy um i weighed myself at the gym yesterday i usually weigh myself at my parents house but we 
didn't see them yesterday so i ended up weighing myself at the gym so i was 82.2 so i haven't really lost much at all since like last week but it is a different scale so i did film a little bit after the gym yesterday so i might put that in instead of me talking about it so i just left the gym it's friday and we've got a day off today because it's australia day so it's it was so nice this morning like i still set my alarm for six o'clock i usually set it for five though but I thought, okay, I'll let myself have a little bit of a sleep in. But I ended up like staying in bed for a little bit. And then I got to the gym at like 7.30. And then like I've just left. So I've only spent like 40 minutes there. But I wasn't even sure what I was going to do. I was just like, I'll just get on the elliptical when I get there. And then I'll just sort of go from there. So I was on the elliptical. And then I just did some of the um, cable. It's like the cable um resistance cable machine because um my physio has sort of like given me exercises to do so i do those um and it's just meant to like strengthen my like core so i do those like i sort of stand at an angle and just try to like keep straight basically um so i did those and then i did some more like just exercises that the physio gave me to do so it was nice it was like productive um and I just did some stretches because I had the most crazy, I had the craziest cramps last night. Like it actually woke me up. It actually like woke me up during the night because one of my legs was cramping like crazy and it was so bad and it lasted like, for me it's a long time, but it lasted like a couple of minutes. I think it was a couple of minutes or it could have been longer, but it was just like, oh my God, when is this gonna end? It was just like so intense. Like I'd never have, I'd never have an intense cramp like that before. And it made me think of like footy play, maybe stretching would help. So I did some stretches for my legs. A really nice start to the day. I did weigh myself. It was a different scale because I usually weigh myself on my parents' scale. Like they have a scale at their house and I just use that. Like every Friday we have dinner at their place. So I'll just weigh myself Friday evening sometime. Oh. Uh, hang on so i ended up weighing myself at the gym because we're not gonna like we're not gonna go to their place today so i thought oh that's fine i like i weighed myself at the gym because they've got a scale there and i only lost a tiny little bit so i guess i'll talk about that more tomorrow but i don't know i'm just kind of like oh well it's a different scale like who cares you know it's a different time of day it's fine whatever but um yeah so i'm just kind of like okay <laughs> you know so i don't know this week's weigh-in is like not very exciting because it's like it could be because it's a different scale you know but it, yeah it's still a loss so it's like a tiny tiny little loss but it's still a loss and i don't really know i'm just going to take it with like a grain of salt because i feel like ugh, it's such a small amount but it's a different scale and i know i've done well this week so that's fine but i will talk about that more tomorrow but it's like a tiny little weight loss and it could be because it's a different scale and there's all sorts of factors that you know that could be why it's not much of a loss but considering that i've had three days where i think i've gone over obviously like yesterday i mean i weighed myself before like the first thing in the morning yesterday so i suppose like yesterday doesn't really count but i'm still kind of happy because i'm still like on that downward like i still lost some weight and you know I'm, it's a different scale so i'm not like super worried about it like i'm not like oh my god i didn't lose much at all i'm just kind of like okay cool like continuing on like i'm still gonna just be like doing the same things i'm thinking like because this week my sort of like leftovers that i would have after work was chili con carne and i actually had like heaps of leftovers from the previous week so i was eating that um and i think next week i think like for week five i think i'll do the sushi bowl again because like oh 
that slapped like it was so it was so good like oh my god and i was just thinking about that and because the last shop i did tuna was half price so i got like plenty of canned tuna so i could like meal prep my sushi bowl but um i didn't actually make it this week because i just had so much of the chili con con left and then like i think the other, one of the other days we had um salmon we just had salmon and beans and that, that was really really nice so just you know sticking to what i know really um it was nice like, like yesterday was nice like just having time to cook something a little bit more elaborate like i know spaghetti is pretty basic but you know it's just like cooking something a little bit different like i just don't really cook that that much anymore and you know my daughter as i said like she really really wanted spaghetti so it was just kind of nice to like be like okay like i'm gonna go to the shops and like i actually went to the supermarket twice yesterday because in the morning when i came back from the gym and i was like okay i'm gonna do like a um you know sausage and egg like english muffin thing i was gonna say mcmuffin it's like it's not a mcmuffin it's just english muffin anyway so we didn't have any eggs because i go through them i'm like guest on right now like i go through eggs like it's nothing at the moment because i go i have like at least two a day you know there was one day i mean of course there was a day last week where i actually forgot them so i had no eggs at all and oh it actually honestly wasn't too bad um and then there was another day where i just had one and it was fine um and i was thinking to myself like maybe i could actually just have two like i probably don't even need three like i could probably have two there was actually one day where i had boiled two eggs because i guess i just was trying to ration them out for the rest of the week i had two and then aisha had the one she had one of them in the morning and i was like oh okay so i just had one that day but it was fine honestly like it was it was totally fine and like keeping in mind that like i do have an iced coffee like that's kind of what the first thing i have i'll make that in the morning and then i'll sort of sip on that like driving to work and then i just kind of finish that at work and it's just like oh it's so delicious Moving forward to next week, I'm just going to probably minimize takeaway. Um, I'm going to really think about like, okay, what days are we actually going to have takeaway? And of course, like the weekend is just as important as the weekday. Because like, you know, as I said, like last week, we did have takeaway. I'm pretty sure it was the Saturday that we had takeaway. Um, and I just want to be like, okay, like... The weekend is just as important as the weekday you know i don't want to just be too like um you know lenient with myself like oh yeah you know it's fine like we can you know we can have takeaway the first time we got takeaway like at red rooster i was very meticulous i was like okay like what am i gonna get you know i was really looking at okay how many calories had i had that day which was probably like none and you know how many calories and that like what am i gonna get so i just want to like really make sure that i'm just still really aware of like okay what am i gonna have like yeah like let's have something you know like obviously if it's gonna be on the odd occasion especially if it's like less than once a week i think like for me ideally take away less than once a week would be good i think like once a week you know like having a particular day where we have it i don't really want to do that just yet you know like maybe in the future we might do that but for now i don't want to have like this set day because we did do that last year where it was like on thursday we can get takeaway you know we sort of had a day that we can do it and then i would just rather even keep it less than that because it just feels like too i don't want it to be too frequent anyway that is my check-in for week four thank you so much for clicking on this video and please like and subscribe so you can follow me on this journey bye